Hi, I'm Ray Smith, VP of our Supply Chain Portfolio here at Microsoft. Now, the past few years have challenged us in about every way possible. We all know we need to come together to face these ongoing global challenges and meet them head on. At Microsoft, we're helping our customers to do more with less, working with their existing investments and interoperating with other market-leading solutions to achieve their goals across their value chain. Now, we've all felt the real-life impacts that supply chain challenges are having on our daily lives, from product delivery delays, stockouts, food shortages, and higher overall costs and prices, just to name a few. And there's rising pressure from consumers for businesses to operate more sustainably now. Supply chain and operation leaders play a major role in driving efforts to reduce carbon emissions and combat the impacts of climate change. They do so by influencing how raw materials are sourced, transported, manufactured, delivered to customers, and ultimately recycled at the end of their useful lives. I'm excited to share with you the investments we've been making to address these challenges and how Microsoft has taken our own steps to sustainability by adopting circular centers. Gartner confirms that one of the three key areas organizations should focus on to have a meaningful sustainability impact is long-term resource preservation. Whether we talk about food shortage in the grocery stores, silicon shortages impacting the electronics industry, or a lack of lumber in the construction industry, we are simply consuming resources far too fast and we are regenerating them. It's impossible for supply chains to operate like this long term. Slowing down our consumption of resources and investing in better waste management practices like a circular economy are key methods to extend our resources. So if our goal is to create a circular economy, then what does our current economy look like? Unfortunately, it's the opposite of circular. We take, make, and waste in a linear process. We consume raw materials from the earth, produce end products, and eventually throw them away as waste. So what is a circular economy? A circular economy is a system solution framework that tackles global challenges like climate change, biodiversity loss, waste, and pollution. Two years ago, Microsoft began to explore the potential of circular centers. In the past, we would simply send or decommission assets to third-party IT asset dispositioning centers, or ITADs for short, and we would remarket or recycle the devices as they considered appropriate. But as the cloud grew, we knew there had to be a better way to manage our end-of-life assets to support the strategic goals that we have as a company. Enter circular centers. Using Microsoft Dynamics 365 supply chain management and Microsoft Power Platform, we've created a reverse supply chain management solution. We use it to manage our warehouse operations like inventory handling, processing of decommissioned servers, as well as parts harvesting. The flexibility, security, and ability to customize the solution means we have been able to design a process that enables us to massively optimize our reuse, resale, and recycling of decommissioned assets. So far, the Circular Centers model has achieved 83% reuse and 17% recycle of critical parts. This is an incredible achievement. But we're not stopping there. Our target is to have 90% reuse of our computing assets internally and externally by 2025. We've also contributed a reduction of carbon emissions by 145,000 metric tons of CO2 equivalent. The use of circular centers is an amazing contributor towards our goal to be carbon negative and zero waste by 2030. We've learned an incredible amount over the past two years, and we move forward enthusiastically as we continue to expand our centers globally. I'm delighted that I get to share the potential of circular centers with you as we all strive to operate more sustainably. Contact us for more information on how reverse logistics can help you drive a circular economy. Now, I'd like to shift gears and show you the amazing investments we've been making in Dynamics 365 supply chain to tackle many of the other challenges we know our customers are facing in the supply chain space. We've been working closely with our customers to design solutions that help them balance their investments to create a resilient and agile supply chain to ensure their business continuity. Now, let's take a look at a video covering some of these amazing new features. Microsoft Dynamics 365 Supply Chain Management can help your organization exceed customer expectations, mitigate financial risks, and make a significant impact. Let's explore the new features in the release wave too. Meet Ryan, an inventory and planning manager. One of his key objectives is to hold the optimum level of inventory without tying up too much capital. 
Leveraging the inbuilt supplier performance dashboard, he learns that there is a high probability that one of his key suppliers can't deliver compressors on time. This is a big risk, since the compressor is a key component for the heat pumps that his customers are waiting on. Ryan acts immediately using the new sourcing from vendors and other regions feature to overcome the risk. Ryan is also focused on predictable delivery. In the past, this meant consulting different systems, finding back emails, and being on the phone most of his day. Now, with the new Allocate and Reserve WHS items in Inventory Visibility feature, he can reserve on-hand inventory for his most strategic and profitable distributor. Next, with the Demand-Driven Materials Requirements Planning feature, he can protect and promote the flow through the supply chain with strategically placed decoupling point stock buffers. It tells him how much inventory to hold and adjusts them dynamically based on different events. This means Ryan sees an increase in customer service levels, optimized inventory carrying costs, and prevented stockouts. Ryan also wants to increase agility and productivity in his warehouses. When responding to the need for additional Swedish satellite warehouses to accommodate bursts in demand, he accelerates implementation using the guided warehouse implementation wizard, delivering faster time to value. Using the new packing capability feature within the warehouse mobile app, workers can now pack, label, and ship goods quickly without being tied to fixed packing stations. Communication has also improved thanks to the new display product information in the user's language feature. With the new capabilities in Dynamics 365 Supply Chain Management, you can further improve your inventory visibility and planning and agility of your warehouses. We've just explored some of the incredible new features we've designed to help customers do more with less. And now, I'm excited to invite you to join me at Microsoft Supply Chain Reimagined Digital Event on November 16th to learn more about building agile, connected, and sustainable supply chains. You'll hear from Microsoft leadership team, including Panos Pane, our Chief Product Officer, and Chris Capasella, our Chief Marketing Officer, on the evolution of our supply chain strategy. I will also be joined by other leaders at Microsoft, customers, and partners, including Mitch Ahrens, EVP of Operations from Kraft Heinz, and our very own Microsoft supply chain leaders. Together with our customers and partners, we will share best practices on how you can gain more resiliency in your supply chain, improve efficiency, and create more sustainable and differentiated value chains. We look forward to having you join us at this exciting event. It'll be absolutely jam-packed of amazing new capabilities and announcements. We'll see you there.